I feel like the takeaway for me with another Seattle Mariners victory against the Yankees and another series victory for the Mariners against the Yankees is not about the Yanks. And I promise you, I'm not trying to push aside Yanks' losses. They're not playing good baseball. But, Donnie, this Mariners team that had a slow start to the season, we they had the fantastic win streak going into the deadline. We know the Astros beat them up a little bit. But this is a team that is just continuing to put the appropriate results up on the board. They've got – and look at this next slate of games here. Three versus Texas, three versus the Angels, three versus Oakland, and two versus Washington. They are going to be favored in all of those baseball games unless they possibly run into a Shohei Otani start. This is a Mariners team that certainly feels legit when we talk about AL contenders. Yeah, nice comeback, too, yesterday against the Yankees. You have that Higashioka home run. Hey, it looks like the Yankees probably going to pull this one out. Not the case here as the Mariners go 4-3. And maybe this is one of those teams that does get hot at the right time. You added a nice quality pitcher there at the deadline from the Cincinnati Reds in Louis Castillo, and you match him up with Robbie Wright. We talk about getting to the playoffs. That's a nice one-two punch. And also, I always like to use this angle, Kevin. We're all human beings out here. If the Mariners have lost 11 straight to the Yankees heading into the playoffs, that's going to factor in. And if Louis Castillo went into the Bronx in that first game where they matched up where he came over to the Mariners, and hey, man, he only lasted three innings, Kevin, seven earned runs. He's going to have nightmares when he goes back to the Bronx. That's not the case here. And this does matter. When these two teams, if they do line up in the playoffs, the Mariners aren't going to be the team that say we're just happy to be here and the Yankees are so much better because they pulverized us during the regular season. That's not the case. This is a very good hitting lineup in a pitcher's ballpark. And if they get performances like Mm -hmm. close wins too, Kevin, this isn't one of those where, hey, just got away from the Yankees, 11-3, didn't take it seriously for the 7th, 8th, and ninth innings. That's back-to-back games where you had a one to nothing shutout of the Yankees in 13 innings and then allowed them to only get three runs in the following game. Mariners are pitching and getting some timely hitting. This could be a good baseball team coming down the stretch.